all right guys and welcome back to my channel i am at my office and as you can see i have like no cars i only have three i've been super busy tax season has been insane all the cars that i bought previously in the past three you know three to six weeks have sold i bought them cheaper before they went up in price right now i'm not really buying anything um i went to carmax auction everything was like 1k or over what i would sell them for so it is insane but i do have this car that i actually purchased two weeks ago i thought i had a good deal on it i'm not sure anymore but we'll see so this is a 2005 toyota corolla with about 210,000 miles on it and i did buy it with the check engine light so i'm just going to show it to you real quick so this is the car so you can see all the paint is messed up and i've already ordered the headlights so you will see me later fix that up um, it's pretty dirty i'm going to order some wheel cap wheel covers to put on there um, as far as the paint right here it's, it's just kind of dirty but um, i'm thinking of just painting up here the roof and the hood just to let, leave it really nice and pretty and you'll see the inside it's not bad at all for an 05 and i believe this is a one owner car so i'm pretty happy about that now i will say uh when i first got it it, it did have the check engine light on and i got it inspected Got it inspected by my mechanic and it turned out to be a catalytic converter so i went next door to my guy and he went ahead and and got it for me and got it done so we just recently did that i'm gonna go ahead and re-clear the code i had cleared it earlier but i'm gonna redo it because that's what he told me to do <laughs> and yeah then i will take it home and work on it there because it is spring break and I need to stay home, but it sounds pretty good when you turn it on. It drives really well too. And I'll go ahead and just reset the code just in case. So we're here in my garage and I'm going to start off by just masking the car around the edges. I. I'm going to start sanding and I don't want to sand down the fenders. I don't really care about the headlights, so I'm not going to cover the headlights since those are going to be replaced. And just for reference, um, I'm going in with a 600 grit. Honestly, with tough work like this it might be better just to go in with a 400 grit first to kind of tackle down all of the rough spots but i had to work with what i had so i'm doing 600 and i'm gonna go throughout the whole hood you won't see me do the top of the car and the back of the car but i will be doing that as well this is extremely tedious and takes a very long time i'm not sure how many hours I was here for maybe like two or three or so.
So, so far I've sanded down all the parts that I wanted to. Um, I think that's as good as it's gonna get. So I'm gonna come in with my primer, uh, primer filler. And I don't like the spray can on this just cause it's like a very narrow spray in itself if you see how thin like the lines are, but it's all right. We wanna cover up all the metal that's showing through. And I'm gonna go over it two or three times after this to make sure it's covered up. Once it's dry, you wanna use a thousand grit sandpaper to lightly smooth it out. And then once you have that all cleaned up, you can go ahead with your base coat. Now here I've already sprayed, I think between two or three coats and I wait 10 minutes between each coat to dry. And I won't be recording this, but about an hour after this color drives up, then I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the 2K clear. And I use two layers of 2K clear, sometimes three. And like I said before, I wanted to change out the headlights. So this is me in the nighttime changing them out in my garage. And here is the final result with the car painted, all the covers put onto the wheels, headlights have been changed. Um, and I'm really happy with the outcome. This car is super popular here in my area. Um, Venezuelan people, Hispanic people, I mean just anybody really likes a good nice running Corolla and yeah whoever gets it is gonna be happy and is probably gonna have no idea what it looked like before. Thanks for watching, make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys on the next one.